realize oh, how everything changing? I mean, so much things changing. Nowadays, things are not only changing, but they're changing fast. But sometimes I just sit down and think about the old days. Y'all did ever do that? Think about the old days and how things changed. Like how we got motor car. When we used to add donkey car, them kind of thing. I just be thinking about things like that. And there's some things that I like that change and some that I don't like. For instance, I love the fact now that we have a toothbrush. Because when we were small, we didn't have a toothbrush. And we used to use the finger. And if you can look here, you see here, rear out. When I go to get my finger, or the people are always saying, Mr. Finger, oh, you have a problem here. There's no print, no, no print here. I can't explain to them, they come on my teeth. And the next thing I'm glad to have is deodorant. Oh my God, deodorant is a beautiful thing. When we the small, we did not have deodorant. And my family used to smell strong. All of my sisters and them strong. I said my mother must be raised in an army. Oh my God. I could smell my sister from far. Somebody called one day, it's past at home. I said no, but she coming. I am so glad they got deodorant. But they know they got some things that I don't like. Like for instance, no, I don't like the fact that the out house, no, in the house. It's not all serious. In the old days, when you used to go sleep on the morning, five o'clock in the morning, a man did not have to wake up to pee. You could just go outside and pee, still sleeping. You walk outside, you know. You? And you got the whole area there to pee. Because, you know, women will know, but men cannot pee straight at five o'clock in the morning. It is a good soul. Me, for instance, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, so. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, so. Sunday, free for all. But now the pretty out house, they put it in the house. Now you got the zero in on that little bowl there. So it is uncomfortable for me, because sometimes the ball here and I hear. You know, I don't like it. You remember before the high toilet paper? I don't know about you, but we used to use newspaper. Anybody here ever had that experience? Newspaper, yes, you buy the newspaper and keep it. And our paper, in my, when I was a child, my paper was called the Daily News. So we got it every day, and we had paper to work with. And I remember one day the Prime Minister get on the radio. His name was Cummins, Prime Minister Cummins. I was about 12 years old. He get on the radio and talk a whole set of foolishness. But I, a little boy, can't do nothing about it. But next morning, I see a picture on the front page of the paper. I tear it off. And put it there so. Are you saying, see you? Yesterday you get on the radio and do as they like. Or your little boy couldn't do nothing. Today you is mine. As soon as this mashed potato settle down, you're going to hear from me. Serious. And some people too used to use brown paper. Yes, but you had to be careful with that. Because you could use that after a fella and don't know. Some people do used to use a rock. Yes, a smooth rock. And when you're done with it, your leg go through the air so shoo! One day a fella let go in rock and then look to see where he throw it. Hit a fella here, the fella said, oh shit. Things change nowadays. Even your women change now. Women nowadays, if you find out that you're horning them, 
You all know he made a horn? Like got another man or another woman? That is cut off your thing. You know that style? Call it Bobby. Shoo. Any women in here would ever bob it? Hey, hey, hey. You would really do that to a fella? Oh my God. You know, since I heard about that bobby, it changed me. I had to change my sleeping patterns. Because I always used to sleep from my back. Because you know in Barbados we got a reputation. So I decided I sleep it by my back because nobody ain't troubling me there. So. <laughs> Lo and behold, this thing come up now. I decide not me. I don't care who trouble me there. Nobody ain't cutting off this. So I sleep it now by my belly. You know what I'm saying? But he got away of getting up on his own. So I find that I just got to be sleeping now like this. So I dig a hole in the mattress and put it down inside there. So. And now I sleep comfortable. You can try the same thing, brother. You wouldn't have to dig a big hole, just a little scoop would do you. You know that little ice cream tea or teaspoon? Yes. Yeah, and watch me. And ladies, listen to solution. Women are the smartest, most intelligent human beings God ever put on the face of the earth. A woman, a old woman, seventy-five years old, gone to the doctor. When she come back, she stand up in front of the mirror, so, hmm, hmm, hmm. The old boy come to the door. He said, what happened to you? She said, you could talk what you like. The doctor just told me that I have the breast of a 16-year-old. He said, what happened? He ain't telling nothing but the 50-year-old ass you have. She said, no, darling, your name never came up. Salute! Oh yeah! And you see the way white people, the street black people, I don't like it. But black people stupid. If black people only look and learn, nobody will mess with them. No one. Watch me. You notice they make white toilet paper, blue toilet paper, pink, green, every color except black. Because black people ain't supposed to take shit from no...